on Dancing with the Stars, Layla Lee walked like an Egyptian, while Joey Fatone cranked up his jive. But it was a sizzling cha-cha that had everybody talking. Look at him go. Just hours before tonight's finale, Apollo Ono and taking time out of his busy schedule here to join us for an exclusive interview. Hello, Apollo. Yeah. How's it going? <laughs> Seattle fans are going nuts for you. How you feeling for the finale? It's been uh, it's been pretty intense, you know. I mean, everything leading up to this point has been very busy, very hectic. But I finally made the finals, which I said I always wanted to do. I wanted to do the freestyle round, and we have some really really cool things planned for the freestyle. <laughs> Washington State is sure proud of you. What about all this attention that you've been getting about your cha cha? What do you think about that? <laughs> well, you know. I can't control what the judges say. We didn't, we didn't think the cha-cha was raunchy or anything like that. We, you know, we think that's kind of a nasty word, but if, you know, if that's what the judges thought, then uh, we have to tone it down a little bit and come back with a new game plan. All and right, that's what we're going to do this week. Tell you what, Apollo, here's what Len said about it. Take a look, everybody. I can understand all these people thinking it was great, but for me, it was too raunchy. Oh, it, come on, Len! Ah! It's a Latin dance, it's a cha-cha-cha. And what I want to see amongst it all is a little bit more cha-cha-cha. I saw a couple of basics, a few locks. You did that New York. Other than that, it was gyration and raunch. And that's not good enough. What's with him? He seems to get on you every week. Well, you know, like I said, we can, we can never control what the judges say. And because, you know, obviously they all think something different of each dance and they, we all have to please them in a different way. I was happy before we even got the actual scores because the audience rose up, everybody was going crazy. And that's when I was happy. Um, obviously we want to get the perfect score, but I think that's what we can get this week. So Paula, when you get out there on the dance floor, what, what exactly goes through your mind? You know, <laughs> when I'm out there, I don't I, you know, honestly, I, sometimes I don't know what's going on. I like just straight up black out. <laughs> it's just... There's so many people watching. You're, you're a little bit nervous in front of the judges, and sometimes the routines don't go as smooth as you as you'd like them to go. Um, I'm getting more comfortable being there, but slowly and you know, every single week I'm getting more and more comfortable being there. But it's it's hard nonetheless. I want to ask you. You're used to fame. You've won the gold medals. You're very popular. For Julianne, it's got to be a little different. How's she handling this? this? Is her first time out doing this kind of thing? You know, Julianne has, has been really like kind of the staple of this dance competition. Because of her choreography, I think because of her teaching methods, which, look, she's not as nice as she seems on the dance floor. She's very <laughs> intense. And <clears throat> she really lays the hammer down when we get out there. But that's because she wants me to reach my full potential. She wants me to go out there and, and perform well. And uh, it seems to be working so far. I, tell you, I want to take you last week to where you guys faced elimination. Take a look at this, everyone. Ian and Cheryl. Apollo and Julianne, on this ninth week of competition, the couple with the lowest score, and therefore leaving right now. Ian and Cheryl. You know what, I want to, Brittany in our audience, Brittany... Get, get, get a microphone up to Brittany. Brittany was just about... You said you what? You were about ready to pass out when all this was going on, Brittany? What, what, what were you feeling? Were you, what, were you just holding your breath? What were you doing? Um, I was just holding my breath because, like, last week with Joey, how nobody just went and voted for him, and he was in the bottom, too. I was like, oh, no, did nobody go vote for Apollo? Apollo, how did it feel to you? There's got to be mixed emotions because you've become friends with these people. Yeah, you know, those Tuesday nights are the hardest because, you know, it's kind of like a roller coaster ride. We go up and down and uh, be... You don't know what to expect. I mean, nobody, obviously, if you get good scores the night before, you feel more comfortable. But on one respect, the fans are the ones who's really voting and in, in, in the other 50 percent. So when we were up there, I don't know what to expect, you know. And um, it's a little bit bittersweet because you made such good friends with everybody in the show. Everybody gets along and somebody still has to go home because it's a competition. So like I guess it's a little bit bittersweet. Now, you've got the big, huge finale coming up in just hours. What would it do to you to lose it all right now? Well, 
I feel like you know, in, in this competition, there's 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 obviously three people left in the final: myself, Joey, and Layla. And everybody's a great dancer. I was a great dancer. Everybody who's been on the show has progressed so much, and uh, you know, I'm just happy to be here in the final. So you said there you're doing something special. Can you give us any hint, or will they have to kill you? Ooh, the, well, the freestyle is going to be interesting. Um, we have a lot of really cool moves planned. A lot of cool things that um, are very creative. Um, a little bit of a hidden, like a little secret talent that I think that nobody knows that we we ooh, have, ooh. Um, which I didn't know what I have. If I can nail it, if I can nail it, I think that we're going to walk out of there really happy. Can't wait to watch. Congratulations, mm -hmm. Apollo. No, look, vote, vote, everybody, vote often. See Tell you, Julian. We said hi. Take care. Thank you. Yeah.